This is my table. It's really big and it's really beautiful, but you can see, you know, like some of the some of the varnish has come off. Okay, I get it. It's not looking so beautiful, but it is a beautiful table. Like it's gorgeous. Layla, you love my table? <gasps> not the computer, darling. Okay, so mark my words, this table is going to look phenomenal. Okay? Doesn't look so phenomenal right now, but it's going to look amazing. Yes, Layla? Okay. Yeah, it doesn't look so good, but it will. Okay, so off to Ace to try and find all the goodies that I need to do my table. Okay, all my goodies. Nadifa, I got everything to make my beautiful table. <laughs> so guys, I am the DIY queen and I'm going to make my beautiful old table amazing and new. So Nadifa, you told me that I should put the table in the rubbish and get a new one. Yeah? So bad, so bad. I don't want a new one. I want my beautiful one and I want it to look amazing, which it's going to look amazing, Nadifa. You're going to eat your words. Okay, so I've been to Ace and I've spent um, 167 dirhams. So I've got my really coarse um sandpaper at different levels and then i've got my really fine so obviously i'm going to start with the really coarse to try and sand it back going down to really fine so i have a beautiful finish on my table so i have to get rid of all of this yucky uh old varnish and uh, stain so that i can then i've got my wood stain so i've gone with golden oak and then i've got my polyurethane that's going to give me a beautiful shine on top Okay, so this is all my goodies. Now, I've never done this before, but I think I'm going to do an amazing job because I love doing this kind of stuff. Okay, wish me luck. Okay, guys, so you can see that here, I was using, a, well, what I was using initially was a really fine piece of uh, sandpaper. Now, I've got a much coarser piece of sandpaper. So you can see it's doing some really good sanding now. So it's going to take me forever. So I went and got back. Got some coarse sandpaper and now it is going great. Okay, so you can see at the other end, it's got a half done and it's getting better and better down this end. Still so much more work to do, but so much is coming off. Okay, so then what I do is I get my vacuum cleaner and I am just getting rid of all the dust. Okay, so I spent a good couple of hours on it yesterday, getting as much as I can of that color off. I probably could do a lot more. Maybe I'll be disappointed that I didn't, but now all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over with a much finer uh, sandpaper, like 600, even though I've got like 1,500, which is really fine, and I might go over it with that even as well. Um, so I've gone from really coarse to medium to now really fine sandpaper to try and clean it out and smooth it out. But to be honest, I don't want it too smooth because I actually really like seeing all the different colors and knots and, and grains within the wood. So I don't want like a glassy finish. I do still really like seeing the texture of the wood. So anyway, so let's hope that I'm not disappointed with myself when I put on my, um, when I put on my stain that I didn't sand it back even more, but I think it's still gonna be more beautiful than what it was in the beginning. So, yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna go over with the fine sandpaper, wipe it down, and then start with my stain. Looking good. 
So because it's an extended table, I've just opened it up and I've just sort of given it a light sand in between all of the uh, splits so that that way it wasn't dark with old um, stains. So, uh, so here I go. I'm going to open it up and I'm going to do my first uh, colour of stain. So wish me luck. Okay. The colour I've got is honey. So let's hope it blends really well. Okay. Let's do our first line. Oh mm, gosh, looks dark. <laughs> okay, wish me luck. Mm. Oh, looks beautiful. I think so. I think it blends nicely with the other colour. Hopefully I've chosen a good choice. Okay, see how we go. Okay, so I'm going with the grain. Oh, yes. Really Looks good, Nidika, yeah? Yes, mashallah, beautiful. She's making a beautiful table, mashallah. Okay, so apparently we're going to let it dry for four hours. So I'm hoping that once it's dry, that it's really even and that I don't necessarily have to do another coat because I don't want it to be really dark. So, um, so yeah, so once it's done and it's dried, then we can put our polyurethane coat over the top. So yeah, looks good. I like the color. Okay, so it's been on for a good four hours said to get a rag and to rub it off so that's what i've done um so yeah so there's a variation in the wood i don't think if i do another coat it will become more even but to be honest i think i like the variation so yeah so that's the staining done and then tonight i'm going to do the polyurethane okay Okay, so finally the last step, the polyurethane is my final top coat. So hopefully tomorrow when it dries in the morning, I have a beautiful, beautiful table. This just glides on really nicely. Okay, let's have a look in the morning. Okay, so it's still wet. So I've just done my my final and my second coating of the polyurethane so the first coat i think i did a bit thin and i could tell that i missed a few patches so this one is looking much better right so i love the different colors that i can see through the wood grains there you can see i've separated it and there's a little bit of uh, the polyurethane there which i think in between them i will just sand that back a little bit when it dries and you can see that when i put it on it's quite thick and it's still a bit milky here this is the last patch that I did so once that dries that that sort of milky tone will go but I did this one a lot thicker because it then sort of um, merges with each other a bit better like the first coat was a bit thin so I could see the brush marks where this one is looking a lot more of a, a glossy glassier kind of finish so I'm loving my table this looks beautiful okay Pretty much done. So I'll let that dry, sand back those edges a little bit where it's a little bit glunky with the um, polyurethane. Voila, my gorgeous table. Okay, the big reveal. Check it out. Mm, check that out. That is one good looking table. Anyway, if I look closely, I definitely can pick on pieces that could have been done better. But I'm just happy as it was not looking great. It was a bit tired, but I love my beautiful table. And here it is, looking great. Good.